All right, let's get some Cuphead going. Been feeling a little bit delirious today, which means that it's the absolute perfect time to play a game that requires, you know, high amounts of precision and reflexes. All right, and I think last time I was stuck on that guy over there. May as well get right to it. Don't remember what this guy's pattern was really. Okay, so that's right. I had the, uh, oh, got to get back in the swing. Yeah, that's not the swing. So how did I switch shots again? Okay, I had the invisible dash. Oh, that's how you did it. I got to, I got to remember how this game is played. Oh, wait, let me check the volume real quick. I forgot to do that. It's muted. You know, it'd be good to not have it be muted. I should probably return to the map. seems fine here, but the uh, in the game is where it's going to be a concern. So I guess just tell me if, you know, audio is, you know, the levels are good. If you can hear me good compared to the game. Okay, so this is L buttons how I switch weapons. That's right. It, it's been a while. Been a little bit. And this is probably not a good boss to come back to. Oh, yeah, that's right, I can just hold down the button with this one. Gotta remember how the game is played. Oh, yeah, I remember these guys, though. Oh. Now, remembering them and actually being able to fight them is an entirely different tale. I'm gonna turn it down just a notch. That's just my paranoia setting in, but... Mm. Yeah, I remember this guy being kind of difficult, and I fully expect that to still be the case. Oh dear, that's not a good, not a good setup right there. In fact, I should probably turn it up on my end a little bit. Yeah, there we go.
Yeah, I, I'm remembering a bit more of this than I thought I would. So I think these guys have a pretty simple pattern once you get right down to it. Okay, so this is the part where I wanted to switch because these things are bad news bears. Oh, as is that. Yeah, that's not good. If I, oh. Yeah, I'm starting to remember getting those flashbacks to the war. I mean, it's been three months, so... In fact, it might have been even more. The point is that it's been, there's been a bit of time since the last time I played this. I'm not trying to use that as an excuse, just stating it as like a matter of fact kind of thing. Oh, oh, I was gonna dash through that, but I didn't do it in time. There went my hopes and dreams. The one good thing about this shot is that even though it's a little weaker, you kind of can just focus on dodging the guys instead of like also having to make an attempt to damage the dragon. Of course, you know, then I'll just still do something like that. Well, we got Smash Ultimate coming out real soon. Got two more full days. We at Nintendo are pleased to announce that Cuphead will be joining the battle. The DLC will include Mugman as an Echo Fighter. I'm not doing good this time. You know, in retrospect, there's probably a better controller I could be using for this than an Xbox 360 controller. It's not like the analog stick is a, a huge necessity with this game. I forget how many, like, unique actions there are, though. Well, I mean, like, obviously I'm using them, but... I'm not sure how many buttons would need to be mapped. I could potentially use my SNES pad. Oh, how did I live? And yeah, that's about that. After this round, I might want to look at, like, what gear I have. Might be a good idea to look into something. Also, I have mixed feelings about this dash. On one hand, it's very useful to become invincible, but on the other hand, it's very not useful to become invisible.
So yeah, I'm, I'm kind of mixed on that. Hey, copper. Back to the old grind. Alright, so I made it here with full health. That is a good thing. Oh, no, no. Might be a good idea for me not to attack while he's doing this. He says, I mean, well, to be fair, I thought he was done. You gotta be very strategic. Oh. <laughs> Standing on the top platform, huh? You might be onto something. You just might. Also, I need to keep an eye on my special meter, but that's more of a task than it sounds like. I can't wait to perish in hell! Oh, so that's- so that's not- so that's not actually what I want to do then. I thought you were just calling it Quick Boomerang as a joke. Oh. Oh, I said I would go look at my upgrades. I didn't do that, however. I'm sure you've noticed. It's just so easy, though, to get back in the fight. Oh, nope, nope. Uh, let's see what gear I have. I don't exactly remember. So it might be good to find out. Oh no, that's not what you want. You want to press Y. Okay, so I got the, um... Got the boomerang thing. The homing, the spread shot, and the pea shooter. I think I'm probably good on that. Super. What supers we got? Hmm. I could try using invincibility. You know, why not? Not take damage, damage during a dash. Automatic carry. Autofill meter. You know what, I think I'll do autofill meter, and then, let's try something different. The robot better change tactics, and fast! You know, I should probably have this as my first weapon, all things considered. Yeah, I think I might get more use out of the the quick refill uh, super bar than I would uh, than 
than I would uh, anything else. Than I would the dash. I mean, not that the dash isn't useful, but I just feel like I'm decent enough at dodging the attacks here, so I feel like, you know, it's just not as useful as it could be. See, I feel like this is the easiest phase for me if I just pay attention to what's going on. Like, this part right here definitely feels like a bit of a Mega Man pattern. Oh, that's not as, that's not as good as I really hoped it would be. Neither, neither is this strategy. Yeah, I'm not feeling that super anymore. The invincibility period's just not long enough. What do you mean two out of three connected? God dang it, restream. Well, which out of the three? Oh, it's Smash Cast it's having problems with. Weird. This would be a bad time for me to get my first Smash Cast viewer, but what can you do? So, I'm gonna go back to the energy beam, personally. boss is quite a thing, I will give it that. Well, well, run's over. Yep, run, run is over. Rip, rip run. You know, it would be nice if it was more obvious when your super meter was full. Because I find myself a bit oblivious to when this is the case. It seems like the upper, the upper quarters. Yeah, something. Like a noise, uh, a noise cue or a mo more obvious one would be absolutely lovely. Hmm. 
Mamma mia! Mamma mia, that's a spicy meatball! Yeah, this is a game... This is a game where I feel like my commentary does kind of suffer because I'm focusing my energy into beating the boss. Especially this one, which is quite... quite a process. If I may say so myself. Like I said, back to the old grind. Yeah, there's just there's just some games that just kill my commentary altogether. Like rest in peace commentary. This is unfortunately probably one of them. Yeah, this probably would have been a good game for me to bring on uh, some co-commentary with. I'm trying to work on standing on my own two legs, though, but... Yeah, I just figured out the technical side of it, getting the filtering done and everything. It might be the best idea for me to just wait it out and use my super or something. Ugh. Like, this is insanity. This is, quite frankly, an abomination in the face of God. But yeah, having having co-commentary for Cuphead in the future might be a good idea. So I'll keep that in mind for the future. I mean, can you even call this level design? It's more like boss design. Like, what level? Oh, nope. Nope. Doesn't count. You know, you know, actually, let me, uh, rectify a thing real quick. Also, are you ready for this entire stream to be just, just this boss? Because I am. Yeah, switch him around. Well, excuse me, princess. Okay. So, start out with the, uh... With the humming shot. Yeah, I'm a little... I'm a little late to the whole Cuphead train. Not to mention this being three months after my last stream of it. And that doesn't help. Yeah, I mean, this this part of the fight has pink objects, but it's like the, the later two phases you got, like, nothing. No! No! This match will get red hot. Here goes. How dare you! Sir Dragon, you have insulted my family for the last time. You have made a mockery. A mockery of me, and frankly, a mockery of yourself. Okay, now that's just, that's just rude. That is just patently unfair. And frankly, I, I don't take too kindly to it.
Oh, uh, you know, like Castlevania levels. I'm just not even gonna use my super here. I'm gonna save that for phase three. The flaming Hotman do not require my full power. Okay, so for now, my plan is just stall until my super meter fills up again. Maybe take a couple shots when I think it's safe to do so. Yeah, it seems to be strictly in the center. It's the boring way, but it's the possibly safe way. Except if I keep accidentally hitting them. You can get a couple, like, decent shots from there. Oh no! Oh no. Oh dang it, I misjudged. I misjudged my life. Here's a real high class Here goes. Oh no wait, I forgot I said it to start on this. Gonna have to press L. Can I just save some more supers for the last phase, please? I mean, this boss, I kind of, I, I kind of, well, okay, I kind of like it, but I also really don't like it. No. Good day for us. Well done. Now go. No. Luigi. Nice of the princess to invite us to an eight-hour dragon battle. I hope she made a tedious boss fight. The problem with the, with this kind of boss is when you have the when you basically have the other phases down to a science. It's only the last phase that's giving you trouble at this point. You know, actually, nah. It would make sense to just go ahead and use this. Except when I fall into the death zone and there's nothing I can do about it. Beat this nightmare of a bored Sunday. Excuse me. What? I can't understand your accent No, no. I'm a fool. No. I'm a ninny! I'm a ninny! 
An ignoramus! No! No, I'm not. No. I don't like it. This boss can go to hell before it dies. You know, let's just do all the off the you know the offbeat Mario voices tonight. Come on, all the references. You know what they say. All dragons don't uh, Yeah, that's where the voice falls apart. I feel like I should get a period of invincibility, like, right after... Right after this. After that attack. I don't know, it just feels kind of unfair. That I can just... Oh, that I can literally just fall into danger because the platforms move. Yeah, from what I've heard, this is the one- this is one of the most cup heady parts of Cuphead. I'll put that in my review. Of all the Cuphead bosses, none were more Cuphead than the dragon. No! You're not allowed to do that. I'm sorry, you're just- you're just not allowed to do that. You, you just aren't, okay? Lad. Good day for well yeah, this one, this one guy in my YouTube comments asked me to call my next stream Legend of Zelda instead of the Zelda of Zelda, and I mean, since he asked so nicely, I was all too happy to oblige. Don't say that Dustin never did nothing for the people. This is the wrong side of this to be on, but yet, I... never mind. Hey, Greeny Stash, welcome. Back to oh dang I keep but luckily that doesn't take up much of my energy small blessings small. oh no this is going to end poorly oh no it didn't I lived of course I lived! Did you expect anything else? Oh no, I have a shield. I don't like it. This is not a good time to have a shield. Can I aim these down? It doesn't look like it. Also, God blank it. Hang on, I just remembered something. No, I and mean, I probably shouldn't run it. Don't worry about it. Yeah, pretty much the next like five streams of Cuphead are just going to be this. So I hope you are. All, I hope all of you are ready for that. That very real possibility. Yeah, the key is 
to make liberal use of the dash afterwards. That's how you survive. In this world, it's dash or be dashed. I mean, what's there to say about this phase at this point? The fire guys do the jump. You know, they do that. It's their job. They do it well. They're good at what they do. Unless they're trying to kill me, which at this point they're not very good at. But let's not, let's not blame them. That's just me being really good at dodging them, not, not them being very bad at attacking. Like let's let's give let's give him some credit. Oh, let's see. This guy has got it all figured out. Unlike me, who has nothing figured out ever. Oh, good, good, good. Alright, play through the, the first two phases again to get another try at that part. Nah, nah. I'm not salty. You're salty. No, nobody's salty. We're all friends here. Our sodium intake is exceptionally low on this blessed day. This blessed day of cups and heads. I see your I see your comment, but I'll have to pause to read it. <laughs> so are you trying to say that this boss is a giant contradiction? this point I'm thinking my old strategy of just never attack wait for super is honestly my best bet at this point you see when I don't that happens
All right, continuing. Hey, bro. In order to beat the dragon, shoot at it until it dies. How you guys been doing? I've been pretty alright today myself. A little out of it. As I mentioned earlier in the stream. But, you know, overall not bad. Getting real close to the, to the Smash Brothers. And even though the previous Direct put a little bit of a damper on things, I'm still pretty excited. Weren't there supposed to be, like, pink bubbles? Oh yeah, that's because, uh, Tumblr bro oh, no, dang it. That's because Tumblr broke everything and now everybody hates it. Well, more than they already did. Yeah, I mean, if this phase had pink bubbles, then maybe, maybe. And you know, outside the context of this game, this that's probably one of the weirder things I've said. Like, ignore all the other weird stuff I've said because of video games. That's, it's pretty weird. Oh yeah, you can shoot this up. I don't think that helps me in this fight in any particularly meaningful way. But, you know, it's good to know. And you know, you know they say knowing is half the battle. The other half, of course, being red and blue lasers. Might have been green lasers, I don't know. And if Toy, Story, if Toy Story 2 has taught me anything, green lasers are the ones you want to have. Because the green lasers are like the super lasers. It's like, it's like you know, blue, how blue fire against all odds is hotter than red fire? S same, same kind of science at play here. Green lasers are way more, cause way more damage than red lasers. That's just science. I mean, admittedly, there there weren't any uh, there weren't any blue lasers in Toy Story 2, so I can't comment on that. They could very well be more powerful than the green variety, but I have I have no experience to back this up. Yeah, I watched. Uh, I used to use Newgrounds all the time. I think most of us did. Like, if you used, if you had a computer back in the early 2000s, Newgrounds is where you were hanging out.
This is my strategy and I'm sticking to it. gonna take me a while but you know what they say about why do I open my big fat mouth what the what that was a frame drop yeah I mean even even as like a little baby I think I recognize that to toss the kitten over ravine was not a flash game I was terribly interested in playing. What are you guys talking about? This is the best commentary I've had in years. I can technically say that because I think I have been streaming for two at this point. Fireballs, yum! Denied. Supplied. Refried. When you get to a part of a game this repetitive, when you've been playing one boss for an entire hour, in fact more than that if you count the last stream, you gotta get creative with your commentary, you gotta improvise, adapt, overcome. You have to become the commentary. You gotta know how it works. Figure out how it ticks. Oh yeah, the Bullet Bill games were great. In fact, maybe I should stream some of those one day, now that I'm thinking about them again. Oh, oh, nope. Oh, I took a damage, but that's okay. I can sustain a single damage. I'm gonna try this strategy. It's going to be boring and monotonous, just like daytime television. But I'm gonna do it. Okay, another tweak I think this game could benefit from. Some kind of indicator when you're off screen to show where you are. Like, like, you know, kind of like how Smash Brothers does it. Because I feel like there's a lot of times in this game where you're going to want to be off screen. Yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing right now. See, I don't know. I remember having a lot of fun with Newgrounds, but I was also a small child with no concept of quality that, saw, that thought Sonic 06 was an actually decent game. So, take my opinion there, with a salt. Much like I am achieving with this boss. Oh no, I don't think that it's the... Well, I mean, maybe for some people it's the ban of not safe for work content, but I think the actual problem, or the bigger fish here, is that Tumblr is flagging a whole bunch of stuff that isn't actually inappropriate. So not only is it going to get rid of all, you know, not safe for work content, it's also going to just get rid of a lot of content 
if there's a lot of false flags. And and this is why this is why as of currently robots are just not good enough. We need the human touch. But Tumblr and YouTube cannot provide the human touch. So we're in this we're in this, you know, point where you know, they just pretend that robots are good enough and then close their eyes and, you know, go la 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 when you try to claim otherwise because they just can't do anything else. Like, listen, listen, they gotta prevent copyrighted music from being played on YouTube, but they don't have the time or the manpower to actually do it themselves. So they gotta, they gotta hire, they gotta hire Robot Jones to do it for them. Except Robot Jones doesn't know what music is. So, oh no. I mean, let's be real, nobody's, nobody's gonna listen to one of my, like, hear a copyrighted song on one of my streams and think, dang, now I don't have to buy it. Oh no! Okay, I'm gonna try one more time with that strategy, but I have a feeling it's not working out for me. But yeah, so basically, this is unrelated to Tumblr, but copyright has gone completely insane. Like... I, I kind of want to stream the Tony Hawk games, but um, the copyrighted music makes that more tricky than it needs to be. Though, I think most of them allow you to mute the audio, so I could, in theory, play Tony Hawk on mute and then um, just add my own music over the top. But, I mean, it's, it's just not... It's just not... Uh, it's just not the authentic experience unless you're getting, you know, punk rock music going like, like black market eternity and I'll never be a dancer. Like it's just not the same Tony Hawk experience. <laughs> yeah, they try they try to invoke the Mandela effect. The actual story behind that is that um they were using a Macintosh uh they were using like a Macintosh voice, but uh Apple was like, "Oh no, Sonny Jim, you can't do that." So they were like, "Oh crap. Well, what do we do now?" But at least that's how I remember it. You were gaslighting. <laughs> I don't remember much about that show. I wouldn't mind watching it again. The only thing I remember is the voice thing and um and how a couple of the characters wore like energy domes on their head. I don't remember if it was like copyright from Apple. I think it might have been. But I remember it was like a Macintosh. Oh. <laughs> it was like a Macintosh voice synthesizer. Man, they should have they should have made a deal with Microsoft and had Robot Jones be voiced by Microsoft Sam. Okay, so I got one health, and I'm pretty much gonna die any moment. Cause I'm a fool. See, see, it's like whenever I think it's safe to take a shot, this is this dragon's just like, nope. Go to hell before you die. We designed Cuphead to be the most fun game that mankind has ever laid its eyes on. 
you know, if there's one, like, really good thing about games like Cuphead and, you know, to a lesser extent, some parts of Undertale is that it shows that, uh... You know, I forgot what I was saying. Oh, yeah. That, the thing I like is that it shows that, you know, games don't have to be, like, super-duper easy sauce to achieve appeal. Because I I think that for a while there, you know, there's a lot of game companies still afraid that if anything is, you know, too hard, that it's, it's just not gonna, you know, it's just not gonna catch on. People aren't gonna like it. You know, people are going to be repulsed. But, you know, I, I think there's a lot of games showing lately that that's not necessarily the case. You can have, you know, you can have a, a game that makes you want to, like, rip, you know, like, rip your lower regions off of your body. Like this one is currently doing to me. Oh. Free! Do I do I have to beat this guy to move on? Yep. Mr. King dies. <laughs> Gotta do it. Mandatory. So I guess the only thing to do is listen to Cranky. This man will get red hot. Okay, I'm gonna try my be a coward strategy one more time. And if it doesn't work, I'll try to be more aggressive. Oh man, that would actually be re a really funny episode concept. Uh, demonetization, I think you mean. Uh, oh, I avoided that somehow. Uh, nope. I'm sorry, but if I take damage on the first phase, run is kaput. Nope. Nope. A great I, I deny. I reject your reality and substitute my own. Yeah, this game's pretty hard, and usually for the right reasons, but there's a couple bits of fake difficulty I'm, a n I'm not a huge fan of. Um, what is everyone's game of the year? I, I honestly <laughs> forget what all came out this year. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you, there's a solid chance it's going to be Smash Brothers. Like, like even with the stuff I don't like about Ultimate, there, there's a good chance it's going to be Ultimate.
Yeah, I'm, I'm choking. Those fire guys were giving me the spicy keychain that time. Hey, I mean, they asked what my game of the year was. They didn't say it had to be game of the year at uh, the VGA. Also, how long have those been a thing? I swear those just kind of appeared one day. I started hearing people talk about it. Yeah, Team Fortress 2 kind of came out like a million years ago, so I don't think that counts. I better focus on this boss super hard. Hmm. I could have been using my special, but what's the point? Like I said, pretty much no indication that your special's even full. <laughs> okay, so... Might as well be shooting while I'm doing that. Not much reason not to. Oh, I mean, I'm not trying to say that Team Fortress 2 is bad. I'm just saying that, you know, it didn't come out this year. Probably didn't even come out this decade. Okay, so that's my strategy, is wait for my special to fill up, and then when they do the flamethrower attack, and it stops being dangerous to actually shoot, then shoot like a mad fool. Because I don't trust my ability to not hit those things. Press the wrong combination of buttons. I have failed Cranky Kong. to win I took a risk and it didn't pay off remember children don't do anything risky nope oh, okay Sorry guys, I'm going to enter hyper-focus mode, because the sooner we can uh, play different parts of Cuphead, the better. Ooh.
Yeah, there's a lot of, like, weird omissions from Smash Ultimate. Like, stuff that I thought was a shoe in Like, there's no, there's no stadium at all? Like, really? I mean, I understand it's a lot of work to put all the fighters plus a few new ones in, but... And plus an adventure mode, but I mean, holy cow. Single player has taken a hit. You know, if thou asks me, which they didn't. The trick is to get to the last phase without messing up a single time on the first two. That's the trick here. The trick is to be literally perfect. Once you figure that out, you're gold. I'm gonna try my strategy one more time, because I have a feeling like it was getting me somewhere. Granted, that somewhere might have been the deepest recesses of hell, but, you know, somewhere is somewhere. Yeah, it's just like, it, it's just too dangerous for me to actually attack when those fireballs are out. It's just too dangerous to actually play the game. It's easier to dodge. You just gotta wait until he does the flamethrower, and then hope that your shots graze the top of his hitbox. And that's it, baby. It's as simple as that. Except I keep having to look in the bottom left corner to see if my super bar is full. So that's good fun. Okay, the time is now. And it didn't even hit him. Absolutely substantial. Sensational. Amazing bet. Simply mind-boggling. Oh. Almost gave myself the spicy keychain there. Oh yeah, you know, you pose a good point. That if I'm going to just, like wait until that phase then it would make sense I guess That was risky of me. And we've already established how I feel about things that are risky. 
the main villain of Shantae can just go... Yes! Also, come on, man. You're the one who told me to t name my next broadcast uh, Legend of Zelda. I mean, you gotta make up your mind, fella. We can finally move on to the next continent. After, like, an entire hour, over an entire hour of fighting that one boss. You gave it to them dead as good. Go on over to the next island. Lots of fun times waiting for you there. These, the little mugs have some fight in them, I'll say that much. They're making mincemeat out of them deaders. You see, I knew there was something special about those fellas. Well, don't be too sure just yet, boss. I think there's something fishy about those two. Don't blow your wig, Dice. If those two little pinks try anything, I'll be waiting. Yeah, it, it pretty much was just Dr. Claw. That's, that's like the only voice I can do. I'll probably do a little bit more, but... Probably do a little bit more, but uh, not too much. Arr, you're gonna need some tips if you want to kill all these deadbeats. Start by mixing up your weaponry. Can't expect all your arms to work the same on every hole. This is the worst pirate voice I've ever seen in my life. Okay, so we'll do a little bit more, but, you know, maybe not too much. Maybe not too much. A great slam and then some. It's all. Uh, does she want to eat me? I sure do hope not. That would be a downer. Alright, trying to pass. I guess this guy is round one. So, my strategy more or less didn't work out. Okay, bro. Oh. Yeah, maybe I should uh, put another gun on. on uh... Yeah, I feel like that dragon took most of, most of it out of me. Hmm. I think I'll go for the pea shooter and the spread shot. I'll try those. And uh, for charm, I could probably switch this out. Mm, let's try this. Let's just do this a little bit. Just, you know, just... You know what I mean? You, you know what I'm saying. Oh. 
do, do the briefcases hurt you? I'm willing to bet the briefcases hurt me. I'm going to stake my rep- oh no, he's already dead. Oh, oh my, oh, Omawa, Moshinderu. Oh no, you, she makes the triangle. Oi. I know, brother, I feel it. Can you feel it moving in the air tonight? Oh lord. Oh, uh, uh. Would you look at that? He's completely unharmed. I did it. <laughs> Are you feeling it in the air tonight, Mr. Crab? You cannot beat me. Maybe she can, actually. No, you can't do that! You ain't allowed to do that! That's illegal! Jerry! Okay, I haven't seen this one before. Oh, it just, uh, just tracks. Is that what it does? It follows. Follows the yellow brick road. Nope. Can't do it. Um, no. no. Please don't. In fact, I would, I would frankly pr No. A brawl is surely brewing. Here goes. Look, you can't just turn into you can't just turn into an aeroplane anytime you feel like it. We live in a society. We have rules. Yes, I said I said the thing. Don't don't lose don't lose your cow. Okay, I kind of prefer this attack over the triangle attack, to be quite fair with you. Uh, this I can actually dodge. Okay. Again, this, this I don't mind so much. I mean, having two of them is a bit of a buzzkill. Ah, <laughs> buzzkill. Get it, cause she's a bee. Nah, actually, get lasered, please. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, sir. That will just never do. Oh, a saw blade. Great. Well, I gotta hand it to ya. Looks can be deceiving when Koopas are involved. Yes.
I've done it. The devil's getting a lot of work in this universe. Rumor Honey Bottoms. If that ain't a name, I don't know what is. Ah, that wolf gang. Always taking ten notes to express two notes worth of music. He has no conception of what I mean by less is more. I knew you can agree with that. I know you can- I know you agree with me. Go convince that tin-eared clock. You won't listen to me anymore. But first, Rugged Ridge. Let's play a video game. Super Mario Brothers. Oh, no. Oh, no. Boomerang. Oh, oh, no. Fire. Oh, no. Death. Oh, no. Death. Super death. A brawl is surely brewing. No, you're not allowed to do that. Wow, this game sure is a video game. I'll tell- I'll give you that much. Oh, can I kill these guys? Actually? It just might be possible. I can't tell. If I can, they have a lot of help. But they're- they're doing the- the thing. They're doing the video game thing. Dragon is back, and this time, uh, I couldn't think of anything to say there. Yeah, maybe it would be a good idea to take that guy out as soon as possible. Because of things like that. Adventures in the Hidden Temple. No, guys, I'm absolutely not ste gonna steal an idea from this level for Super Ancient Keys, don't worry about it. Am I supposed to kill him? It's entirely possible. Oh no, it but it's something one can do, if one is so inclined. Nope. No tiny devils allowed over here. Or maybe, maybe that's just Danny DeVito from Hercules. Oh, hey, nice, uh, nice statue in the background of what's her face? Chalice Lady. Nice, nice statue of whatever that is. I don't, I don't like him. Yeah, that's about what I figured. Am 
Am I supposed to be shooting at this guy? Oh. Oh. O-A-P. We're gonna die, Morty! But we have some uh, have some coins now, so we can buy some new moves somewhere. Not everyone earns a great A rating, if you know what I mean, and not everyone can maintain that level of quality over time. Consistency, my dear friends, that is what it's all about. Then you will experience the scintillating sensations that I do. Lobber. Your first parry move doubles as a damning accident. Does that mean first parry like the first I'm I do? Or or does that just mean like my normal parry move? Alright, well guys, what do you think? What do you think I should get? This sounds vaguely useful. And this sounds like Mega Man. So I'll listen to you guys. What do you think? I, I could take any of them. OP, you say? So let's replace my pea shooter with charge. Oh, we could also get a new super move. Which would be absolutely lovely. You cannot beat me. Nope, 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 denied. Goodness, you came by. Those lousy ghosts had me good that had me but good that time. Here's the last magical super art I was able to find for you. Well, time for me to take a power powder. Good luck. Is that still a thing people do? Powder? Have we have we moved past that as as a, as a society yet? So, what is the final super? Giant Ghost. Maneuver your spirit and body simultaneously for maximum damage. I don't know, that sounds kind of hard. Also, how did I do the ghost thing again? I forgot about the, the ghost thing. How do I do that? I should pr try pressing buttons. Marine Corps.
A great slam and then stuff. It's on. Oh, I know about this one. Oh, okay, so that, that does that. Oh, okay, I see how this works. Oh, oh, that, that hurts me. Good to know. Good to know. This match will get red hot. And begin! Mm, pardon me. I'm doing kind of all right. I can't believe I dodged that. Probably want to bring out the trusty spread shot at this point. Not good, not good. Probably could be using supers, but what can that? Yeah, I'll do it. And we're playing Adventures of Batman and Robin. Oh yeah, that's right. I can hold down the R button to stand still for a bit. Nah. A great slam and then stuff. You're up. Oh dang it. Thought I had it in the bag. You know, soup. Because you don't put soup in a cup usually. So therefore it is the enemy of Cup Von Head. Head and Bog. Hidden Glolfer. Oh. Oh, I'm very bad. I'm very bad. Oh. <laughs> Why do I do that? I don't know, it's just you usually put it in a bowl is what I'm thinking. Can I put this up? No, I cannot. Oh, oh, it's making wood. It's making wood happen. Well, I goofed that one right up, but I think I can do this. After the dragon, I can do anything. Chaos, chaos.
Yeah, you gotta be ca more careful with your timing there than I have been. I sure did goof that one up. Oh, okay, so I can't just duck under it. That's good to know. Today on probably could have guessed. Okay, now I will make sure to hit. Oh, well, that's not how you do it. Cuphead won't be winning that way. Cup von Hedenmiser. Yeah, there we go. Wait, wait. Was that a robot the whole time? I looked at the chat, and I saw a robot. I saw his head was open. Or maybe it was just a clever visual gag. Hard to say. What's my opinion on Undertale? Good. Good, I like it. Captain Briny Beard. Oh yeah, this guy, Bluto. Yeah, the the uh, genocide route kinda sucks. I mean, I get that that's kind of the idea. It's, it's to make it feel unsatisfying, I guess, but, you know, ironic bad doesn't mean good. That, that's what I'm trying to get at here. Is that you knew, you knew the, uh, the genocide path was lame, but then when, then what's the point of advertising it? Like, it's like, oh yeah, Undertale lets you make choices, except you're, except you know, there's a right, there's a right path, and then there's a path that, that's a wrong path. We didn't put any dev time into one of them, but that's okay because we did it on purpose. Oh, there's a shark. But you don't understand. It's supposed to suck. I don't like that. No, sir, I don't like it. Oh, no. The, the, well, okay, I think they're just... They, they don't produce... Luckily... Luckily, I feel like Deltarune is doing a couple things about that. Granted, Deltarune doesn't even give you the illusion of choice at this point. But I feel like, you know... Whatever. Oh, there's a squid. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, he darkens up the screen. Yeah, the Popeye movie, I'm not even really a fan of Popeye, but I'd say Pop the Popeye movie looked pretty good actually. Oh, oh, I get it. They're dog they're dogfish.
I will say, I'm still not a huge fan of how everything is like, feels like it has to be CGI nowadays. But I will say, it's a little bit easier to to stomach when uh when like it gets the art style, you know, just so. Am I able to kill the barrel? That would be lovely if I could kill the barrel. I don't think I can. But yeah, there's some, like, admittedly, as much as it, like, didn't need to exist, I think, from what I've seen of it, the Peanuts movie did a really good job capturing the original art. But yeah. I mean, I feel like you can make Flash look decent, but it's often a lot of... It's often very tricky to do. Oh, I just noticed that the captain gets thrown in the background. That's funny. Oh, yeah. Right. When he closes his mouth... Yeah, I mean... Sadly, I think the glory days, like, as it's, it's a very fitting topic, you know, to discuss during this game, now that I think about it. But I think the glory days of 2D animation is well and truly behind, are well and truly behind us. You know, it hurts to say that, but I feel like the problem is CGI is just, you know, and Flash is just cheaper to produce, and that's what's going to win out. I'm not saying it's right. But, you know, that's probably just the reality we live in. Okay, yeah, so you get a warning that the shark is coming. Yeah, that's... that's a valid point. It's just gonna be, you know... Well, it's... It, it's just gonna be things like Cuphead, let's be honest here. Even though that's a video game. Oh, there we go. I haven't actually watched the Captain Underpants movie yet. Probably should. Read, read those books all the time when I was little. A minus. Man, it's almost like we're playing a video game. Perilous peers, let's do it. Yeah, I mean, like, I feel like it's easier to accept CGI for me if they if they do a good job making the CGI look like it should. You know, if they if they can keep the art style alive, then whatever.
Oh, no. Flick. Agaflignon. Yeah, I don't know what I was thinking there. I'll probably, uh, this, this stage, I'll, it'll probably be the last thing I do tonight. I feel like that would be a, a good place to stop. to invite us over to the pier. No, Mario, it kind of smells like crap. Luigi! And that's how you survive. Gotta do what you gotta do. It's the starfish man. Oh god. <laughs> I don't know how to feel about you. No way, I changed my mind. I, I don't like it. Uh, why'd I do that? Oh, I can parry some of these starfish. I should have guessed. probably have Michelangelo in your name somewhere. Or your name is like a pun on Michelangelo. Oh. I'm good. Yeah, this will probably be the last thing I do tonight. But again, I think that's... That's all right. You know, we, we all have... We all make mistakes. Yeah, illumination is kind of boring me lately. And they're and they're the ones doing the Mario movie. Oh boy. So has anybody here uh, seen the new Grinch movie? Because it it didn't uh, it didn't look very appealing to me, but I want to see what uh, what kind of other opinions we got here. Yeah, I mean, are you ready for Toads versus Minions? Oh. Oh. I'm good. I know how video games work. Oh, lead. You've gone daft, lad. You've gone absolutely crazy. Now, go. Yeah, that's true. Toads, toads are a little better than Minion. I feel like the problem is... Like... I, let's be honest, the only reason I don't like Toads these days is just because of Sticker Star. Let's, let's be real here. It's mostly just because they Nintendo uses them in really boring context instead of actual characters. I feel like you can make Toads interesting. 
You just gotta give them. You just gotta give them something. Like, like, code is not enough at this point. It's gotta be like. <laughs> the Virgin Nintendo Direct versus the Chad Grinch leak. The roster was too good to be true. Yeah, this ain't the right. You know, it might be a good idea for me to have this here. No! <laughs> I fibbed. But I don't know, guys. Maybe there's hope for the DLC. But I'm a little afraid. Come on, Nintendo. Don't give me five Corins again. My heart can't take it. So if they announce like three Fire Emblem characters and two Pokemon, can I can I sue Nintendo for giving me cardiac arrest? No. Honestly, you know, I've kind of taken a couple of pot shots at Bandana D, but, like, the only reason that, you know, I'm really against him is just because I feel like there's so many more interesting Kirby characters. No, I mean, I like Super Paver Mario, but a lot of people didn't, and I understand why. Yeah, like, her... You could do, like, you know, you could get some of the Kirby villains in there, because, I mean, I don't know, as far as villain rep goes, Kirby's kind of weird in that, you know, like, King Dedede's not, King Dedede's not really much of a villain anymore. Like, let's, let's be honest here, King Dedede's basically one of the good guys now. Meta Knight is kind of weird, it's like their attempt at writing... Their attempt at writing a morally gray character, but it, uh, I feel like it doesn't quite, uh, it doesn't quite work out in my opinion. And it just seems like, it seems less like Meta Knight's morally gray and more just like Meta Knight does not care and just does whatever the heck he wants. Like, it seems less gray and just more chaotic is what I'm trying to get at. Yeah, I mean, just just as a word of warning, if any of you, like, spoil Smash Ultimate or, like, some of the things within it, then you will be banned from my stream indefinitely, just so you know. Oh, that makes him shoot. I didn't realize that at first. Oh, no, 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 please. Please, God. God can't save me now.
Oh, I like, I like what you guys, I like what you guys are hinting at here. But no, please, really, do not tell me what it is. I, I got like two more full days to wait. I can do it. I'm debating, uh, I'm leaning towards maybe not, but I'm debating if I want to, like, stream any of Smash Ultimate at first. But I feel like I'll just be playing it too much for that to be feasible. I tried to do a thing there. I might stream some online matches. I don't know if I'm gonna stream, like, uh... World of Light or anything. Or, like, Classic Mode. I just feel like I'm gonna be playing too much of it. For, for me, like, streaming it to be at all feasible. Cause, you know, I have, I have my limits, you know what I mean? I might gotta do this, uh, next time. Woo. Anyway, thank you guys for showing up. I'll try to get a few more streams in before December becomes really busy. Mm. Pardon. Uh, uh, next time, I guess, expect me to try and finish up Link to the Past. That'll probably happen. I don't know when I'm gonna do more Crash. I need to finish Crash, too. Wow.